Dr. Marston, you are an esteemed psychologist with considerable accomplishments, most notably the invention of the lie detector test. Creator and sole author of the Wonder Woman comic books. The movie is so timely and they were so ahead of their time. So I think they're even ahead of their time now. Um, and Marston had this idea that women should run the world and that the world would be a more peaceful place. I write what I see about women I know. Beautiful, brilliant, ferocious. They have the power within themselves to create their own destiny. He was a vocal male feminist in America and he supported the suffragette movement and the birth control movement. He was a strong advocate for all of those things, which I thought was impressive in itself. And then to think that he's the man who used his opinions and his ideas on feminism and radical and a radical existence that he had with his two women in his life inspires the Wonder Woman superhero comic book character is just I just think it's inspired to think that this man did did that and, and what she represents now. She represents the, the the all the inherent qualities that women have that men don't, you know, that they are loving and nurturing and she's one of the only superheroes that doesn't incite war or wants to fight. I think you long for an unconventional life. What we want can never happen. The world can't stop us. When I see this love story, the thing I take away from it is is a group of people who are being true to themselves despite all the odds. Um, and I think for me, that's a good message. Like, always be true to yourself. Supreme of the Wonder Woman? It's too wordy. Why don't you just call her uh, Wonder Woman? I like it. <laughs>